So we got a notification that our Christmas lights are here. I ordered four sets of these icicle lights for my brother at his house in Indiana and we set them up and I'm gonna show you how that went. But I decided to try another brand because I wasn't sure if they were overpriced or not. And let's compare the two sets. We're gonna set them up today when my husband gets home from work and we're going to tell you all about it. This is not a sponsored video, by the way, because no one is paying me to tell you this information. Here's the Amazon package. This is my brother Juan. This product arrived on time, nothing was broken, everything worked. And actually both of our mechanisms are very similar. These little things that you untwist so that you can hook up two sets together are exactly the same way. They work both on his product and my product. And this is actually how his looks. When you punch in shower media rain lights on Amazon, you are going to come up with a ton of options, different prices. Oh my gosh, it was almost overwhelming. This is what I chose for my brother, which is $18.99 per each set, and he got four. The price wasn't amazing, but I went to Walmart and I saw them for $18.88. So maybe that's how much they are. And actually the ones at Walmart only had seven little icicle things whereas the ones from amazon had eight so in that scenario they're well priced the other thing is that if you're gonna light up a whole tree you're gonna need a whole lot more lights or you're gonna have to find a different strategy so we hung them around and i don't know that that was the best strategy but i think my brother was kind of like we're just gonna leave them i'm gonna try a different way of setting them up to see if they're better the ones i got today are cheaper sometimes cheaper isn't better so let's find out. Okay. Meteor shower rain lights. It says blue, white, and multicolors, and I hope these are all white. This is kind of how my brother's came. But off the bat, I can tell this does not look as high quality as my brother's. His was cut, the thing, the prong was right here, and this one is right here. Make sure that it's tight so that it's sealed waterproof and that might be the big difference is the waterproof don't know okay and how many come one two three four five six seven eight exactly like my brothers oh do they look about the same definitely led white but i like it Well, my husband is okay, but after that incident, we decided to use our broom to start to help us. And instead of hanging them around, we went ahead and go up and down. There is a little bit of a difference in how they shine at night. And I wanna show them to you so you can tell me for yourself what you think. I am so undecided on which one of the layouts is better. So if you wouldn't mind, put it in the comments below how you would actually do this. Would you go all round like my brother did, or would you go up and down like we did? Upon reviewing everything, another thing I noticed is that mine said 192 LED, whereas my brother's were 144 LED. And I wonder if that is why they shine different and the coloring of the white is different. One of the meteors, the cover for it came off. So we already have electrical tape on this. I'm all about value and even though this is five dollars per set cheaper I don't know that I got a better value to be fair there are a lot more purchases for the ones I have and they are happy reviews so today is video editing day for me and actually as I've put together this video I've been able to look at all the information once again in a more objective way I think we probably both got good products look nice at least for this season his have already held up to rain mine are still to be tested and mine already has electrical tape was it worth saving the five dollars not necessarily so we're really not going to be able to know until many rains and winds and things have happened whether this was a good idea or not 
I think the way I can solve the updates is just to put it in the description below. So if you see an update, it's because there is something new that you should know about how they're holding up. And unfortunately, as we were putting up the lights, we discovered that we had aphids or some sort of bug infestation on that beautiful oak tree. Now we're either going to have to treat the tree with the lights on or take the lights down and treat the tree. I do want to thank you if you have stuck around that long because that probably means that you and I could become YouTube buddies. I mean, you probably like everything home and garden type of thing and you should consider subscribing if that's the case. Remember that you can create bliss at home and in the garden. See you next time.